basically you remove this 24 24 mil bolt so you the 24 mil socket so remove this bolt that's where you drain your AYC fluid from this one here is where you drain your gear oil from so you open that before doing that I like to actually open up the fill bolt just to make sure you can open it I don't know if you can see it, but it's that one right at the top there. I'll try and point it out. That one there. That top one there. It's a uh, 17 more sprayed with WD-40 and then let it sit for a couple of minutes and then open it. It's just a standard 17. These are your two bleeders. I've taken off the actual bleeder caps. Yeah, so once you open that. 17 open 24 mil bolt and let all the fluid drain out and then i'll show you what to do at the top of all the reservoir for the ayc fluid make sure you use the genuine mitsubishi atf which is an sp3 rating now you can make sure that the reservoir is topped up if you have drained it from the bottom and you've sucked out all the remaining fluid from the top fill it up with fresh fluid make sure it's right at the max line you can fill it a bit above the max line so this way you're safe when you come to bleeding it you won't run it low you'll need an oil pump similar to this to fill up the ayc with the mitsubishi atf if you don't have something like this you will struggle to do the job so fill that up fill it. <clears throat> you fill it in through that hole there, that 17 more bolt that we removed on it. So that's where you, you basically fill it till it starts to uh, overflow out of that same hole. And then you close it. So you use the pump bottle. I like to run it underneath the exhaust. Just up into that filler bolt there. Just up there. That's where it goes in. So you need something to actually pump it in, so I just use one of these oil pumps. When it's topped up, you'll see it drip down. And you just pull out the pump and close it off with the oil 17. So this is how you bleed it using the Tetrix 2.0 cable. Basically connect the cable up to your OBD2 port. Connect it up to your USB, open up EVO scan, and basically just use OP check left and OP check right. Hit the activate button on the left one, and then you do it on the right one, and you bleed at the back. Basically, come here and you open up the lift the left side of the air bleeder and then when you hit the OP check right you open up the right side and I've got my little bottle here and just fold it up into here so you connect up two clear hoses and you can monitor it and as, as you can see we just finished it so fairly straightforward This is the difference between old AYC fluid and new stuff. The new stuff is bright pink. The old stuff is all brown slash dark red. This is why you need to service your AYC. Kills the clutches. Always use the genuine.